Fudge is a type of sugar candy that is made by mixing sugar, butter and milk, heating it to the soft ball stage at 240 degrees Fahrenheit 116 degrees Celsius, and then beating the mixture while it cools so that it acquires a smooth, creamy consistency. Fruits, nuts, chocolate, caramel, candies, sweets and other flavors are sometimes added either inside or on top. A recent trend has been to create novel flavors of fudge, giving vibrant visual appeal at the same time. Fudge is often bought as a gift from a gift shop in tourist areas and attractions. History In a letter written in 1921 by Emmeline Battersby Hartridge, she recounts the purchasing of a box of fudge for 40 cents a pound in 1886 in Baltimore, Maryland. A student at Vassar College in Poughkeepsie, New York, she claimed to have made introduced it there in 1888 by selling her own 30 pounds 14 kilograms batch. The diary of another student mentions making fudges in 1892. An 1893 letter from another Vassar College student describes fudges as containing sugar, chocolate, milk and butter. A recipe for fudges at Vassar was printed in the Sun in 1895. Despite describing the confections as Vassar chocolates, the recipe given comprises sugar, milk, butter and vanilla extract. Word of this popular confectionery spread to other women's colleges. For example, Wellesley College and Smith College have their own versions of a fudge recipe dating from the late 19th or early 20th century. Fudge making evolved a variety of flavors and additives as it grew beyond its popularity at colleges. Chemistry In forming a fondant, it is not easy to keep all vibrations and seed crystals from causing rapid crystallization into large crystals. Consequently, milk fat and corn syrup are often added. Corn syrup contains glucose, fructose, monosaccharides, and maltose, disaccharide. These sugars interact with sucrose molecules. They help prevent premature crystallization by inhibiting sucrose crystal contact. The fat also helps inhibit rapid crystallization. Controlling the crystallization of the supersaturated sugar solution is the key to making smooth fudge. Initiation of crystals before the desired time will result in fudge with fewer, larger sugar grains. The final texture would then be grainy, a quality normally indicative of low-quality fudge. One of the most important attributes of fudge is its texture. The end point temperature separates hard caramel from fudge. The higher the peak temperature, the more sugar is dissolved and the more water is evaporated, resulting in a higher sugar-to-water ratio. Before the availability of cheap and accurate thermometers, cooks would use the ice water test, also known as the cold water test, to determine the saturation of the confection. Fudge is made at the soft ball stage, which varies by altitude and ambient humidity from 235 degrees Fahrenheit 113 degrees Celsius to 240 degrees Fahrenheit 116 degrees Celsius. The heated fudge is sometimes poured onto a marble slab to be cooled and shaped. Some recipes call for making fudge with prepared marshmallows as the sweetener. This allows the finished confection to use the structure of the marshmallow for support instead of relying on the crystallization of the sucrose. This is not true fudge, and can more correctly be called imitation fudge. Hot fudge Hot fudge in the United States and Canada is usually considered to be a chocolate product often used as a topping for ice cream in a heated form, particularly sundaes and parfaits. It may also occasionally be used as a topping for s'mores. It is a thick, chocolate-flavored syrup, flavored with natural or artificial flavorings, similar in flavor and texture to chocolate fudge, except melted so that it can be poured. See also Notes References External links Science of Candy, Fudge, Exploratorium